The proportion of small businesses run by migrants in Australia is significant. Nearly one third are operated by people born overseas. While some find it challenging to enter the workforce because of language or local experience barriers, many use their entrepreneurial spirit to find new opportunities. Koshery. It's a mix of pasta, rice, lentils, chickpeas, fried onion and tomato sauce. This is uh, very popular in Egypt. Every corner, every street, you eat koshery. And he's hoping it'll become just as popular here. I hope to uh, transfer this food to Sydney and all Australia. Walid launched his new business venture at the Eid Commune Middle Eastern Night Markets last week. But food wasn't his first passion. Marine engineering, actually. He migrated from Egypt over a year ago, but couldn't find work as an engineer. I have already a five-year experience, but I don't find any job here because everyone you want local experience. He was put in touch with the New South Wales government's Small Biz Connect team. So one of the things we, I ask them is, what would you like to do, in a sense? So, and, and Walid happened to like making food. And was given a hand setting up his business. Well, we got them to do an ABN number, to do the uh, food safety supervisor role, and the registration in terms of uh, register with the government. Also, we, we got some insurance for him, public liability. One of the best things about operating at a market like this is that you can get instant feedback from the customers you serve. While the excitement of launch night may have contributed to Waleed forgetting why he moved to Australia... Oh, it's because he married me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he did remember his goal. Food truck. <laughs> Food truck uh, from Koshari, from everywhere, from every corner in Sydney. And after finish Sydney, another city, another Melbourne. After finish Australia, go to another uh, country. Small business, big thinking. And speaking of food trucks, you can find out how to set one up yourself, along with plenty more inspiring stories on the first episode of Small Business Secrets. It begins on Sunday at 5pm here on SBS.